I S U P K. interpretation in the Bible. You understand? This Bible right here is only for black, Hispanic, and Native American Indians, man. If you disagree with us, guess who you disagree with downtown Detroit? You disagree with God that created the heavens and the earth, man. I'm going to pass it right back to the powerful priest that was reading. Who, who got the scripture? There's no private interpretation. Second Peter 1, which one is it? 1 and 20. Let's get Second Peter 1 and 20. And this is the problem. We come out here and tell the truth according to the Bible. Meanwhile, America have brainwashed everybody according to this Bible. White Jesus does not exist, man. It's not in the Bible. You understand? Jesus is a black man with really ill with red, red, red eyes. You understand? A man that walked the earth. If you see Jesus Christ, you'd be like, look, look at that nigga right there. You understand? We're, we're, we're white women here. Look at that nigga right there. That's Jesus Christ according to the Bible, man. You understand? And meanwhile, we had civilians run up on the camp and say they don't understand. Why? Because America has told the biggest lie in the earth that Jesus Christ, Yahweh Shammashiach in the Hebrew was a white man. That's a lie. That does not exist in the Bible, man. You understand? The people that's destroyed and oppressed in America, they are the real Jews that the Bible speaks of. You understand? My brothers that's locked up in prison right now, they are the real Jews that the Bible speaks of. You understand? It's no private interpretation to this Bible, man. Read, read what you got. Second Peter, one and chapter, chapter one, verse twenty. Knowing this first. That no prophecy of the scriptures. That no prophecy of the scriptures, man. Guess, guess what the prophecy of America is? This place about to burn down, man. Right. You understand? Right. Right. You see the chains of God every night in the sky looking at this place, man. Right. You understand? Joe Biden is not going to save this place. Right. You understand? You, you, you people that's in, enjoying downtown, you know what's going to happen to you? You're going to be fixing me and my brother's Kool-Aid. And if you drop that right. cup of Kool-Aid, you're going to get this size 11 and a half, and you're behind. That's right. You understand? According to the Bible, man. Let's read some more. Knowing this first, that no prophecy of the scripture is of any private interpretation. So according to these scriptures that we read, man, the King James Version Bible is no private interpretation, man. You understand? And that's our job to let you people know that this book right here, this holy, these holy scrolls right here, is a separatist book, man. It's not for everybody. You understand? Y'all be alright, no sweat. Keep reading. Verse 21. For the, pro for the prophecy came not in old. Uh -huh. The prophecy came not in old, but what? No sweat. We gonna keep it. We gonna keep it moving. I know what the problem with you. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Y'all black people in America, man. The problem is you suffer from a critical mental disease called Stockholm syndrome. You understand? You want to say your oppressors so much, man. The white man. You you love them too much. You understand? But according to these scriptures right here, the man that you love is going to change, man. You understand? Well, let's let's read some more. For the prophecy came not in old time by the will of men, but holy men of God spake as they were moved by the Holy Ghost. Holy men. These brothers that you see right here, man, get these brothers right here. Mighty goddamn hand right here, my brothers, man. We threw the Christmas shit in the garbage when we found out the truth. We stopped saying.
celebrate Thanksgiving. That's we right. stop smoking weed. Right. We stop being hormones and hope, you know what I'm saying? We stop doing those wicked things that America's trained us to do, man. We, we follow the laws of God, you understand? Give me Amos 3 and 1, you understand? Mashad, you, you got it right back, priest. Excellent job. Give, give money man Mashad a money hand, man. You understand? This brother right here threw the Christmas tree in the garbage. You understand? We, we not respect their persons, man. You understand? Anybody battle me? Anybody got any discrepancy with this Bible? Step forward right now. You understand? You understand? Give me every step forward. The major thing in Christianity, which is the first book in the earth, is that y'all think God love everybody. That's not in the Bible. John 3.16, that does not mean God love everybody, man. And we're about to show you right here. Amos 3 and 1, let's go. Help the brother out, man. Somebody get Amos 3 and 1. I don't care if it's on your phone. We got to keep it moving. Amos 3 and 1. So we can cut through Christianity, man. You yeah, understand? Yeah, yeah, no sweat. No no sweat. Take your time. Get his brother a hand right here, too. You yeah, understand? He threw the Christmas tree in the garbage as well. To hell with that Christmas tree, man. Read. Amos chapter 3, verse 1. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel. O children of who? O children of Israel. So guess what? I got, so I got news for you. The so-called Chinese man is not the children of Israel. Right. You understand? Your oppressor is not the children of Israel. Right. Africans are not the children of Israel, huh? Right. I got news for you. So-called Negroes, Native American Indians, you know what I'm saying? These 12 tribes right here, guess what? They are the children of Israel. And that's who the Lord is speaking against right here, man. That's why you on the bottom of every nation, man. Look at these heathens, man, running before the camp, before the priest of God. Y'all princes of the power, man. And they still powerful, man. That's why they hate you so much. Read. Against the whole family which I brought up from the land of Egypt, saying, you only have I known. The most I only know one nation, man. That's what you healers got to, you got to swallow it up and get over it, man. Read it again. You only have I known. The most high only knows black and Hispanic people, man. That's it. He don't know the, Mo the, the Moabites. He don't know the Edomites. He does not know the, you know what I'm saying, all these other uh, heathen nations, man. He only knows black and Hispanic people that's been oppressed. By this goddamn devil. Excuse my language, man. Right. Hey. You only have I known of all the families of the earth. Of what? Of all the families of the earth. Of all the families of the earth. And it's only 18 nations recorded in the Bible, man. The most I say, he only know Israel, man. A holy nation. A holy, a, 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 a royal priesthood, man. Y'all better do your research. These niggas over, these niggas over here are scholars according to the Bible, man. Huh? You understand? Somebody give me Babylon and ten buck too. Page eighty four, real quick, and I'm gonna pass it back to Officer Mashad, man. Which is doing such of an excellent job, man. You understand? Y'all brainwash God so loved the world. I got news for you. World and earth mean two different things, what? dummies. You understand? World and earth mean two different things. That's right. You understand? What is the world? What are you talking about in John 3, 16? The world of Israel, man. You understand? Give me Isaiah 45 and 17 real quick. You understand? We, we, we are here telling you the truth according to the Bible. You know what I'm saying? Some, some of y'all, uh, there's some uh, Edomites that's going to be honorary white people. You understand? Like I said before, if you drop my Kool-Aid in the kingdom, it's going to be a problem. I'm going to say, get the ball. Go kick that <laughs> Like, let me keep my professionalism, man. You understand? It's going to be a pro problem if you drop my Kool-Aid or my brother Kool-Aid. Because that's what we like. You drop one of them goddamn chicken wings. Oh, my God. So, <laughs> Yeah. Right, read that. Isaiah, chapter 45, verse 17. But Israel shall be saved. And the Lord with an everlasting salvation. But Israel should be saved. Not everybody. That's right. You understand? Why your Christian pastor never bring that out? Read it again. But Israel shall be saved in the Lord. But Israel should be saved. You idiots, y'all gonna be in chains, man, when when my when my the king of Israel come back. That's right. I pray you understand. 
You understand? You're going to be in chains, man. We, with an everlasting salvation. With what? An everlasting salvation. Black and Hispanic people going to have an everlasting salvation. Why? Because you're in your kingdom right now. That's right. You're in heaven right now, Mr. White Man. That's right. You understand? But when, 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 it's, when your kingdom done with, you understand? As you can see, COVID-19 got this place stuck. That's right. right. You understand? You see the power of the Lord. You see what the Lord did to Texas, shut this whole state of Texas down. Why? Because me and my brothers across the globe talking to oracles of God, man. That's right. You understand? Read. You shall not be ashamed. You shall not what? Be ashamed. So guess what? In our kingdom, a black man not going to be ashamed to walk the streets. You know why? Because we're going to be in control. Right. You understand? We're going to be in the government of Yahweh Shah Mashiach. Yes. Jesus Christ, a black man. Yes. Right. You understand? Right now, our brothers ashamed to walk past you devils, right? Right. right. You understand why? Because you're the devil that the Bible speaks of. What does that mean? Right. Deceiver and liar. The biggest lie in the world is white Jesus. You understand? Right. Right. Let's read some more. And this is the Holy Bible, the oracles of God. Well, it's not my words. It's not Commander Jenny Hanna's word. It's the word of the Lord, man. Read. Nor confounded, world without end. Nor confounded. Why, hey, why, why, why does the Lord say the children of Israel are confounded? Because if, if I line up all my brothers and sisters out here and ask them their nationality, they don't know. Why? Because your, your forefathers lied to us and told us we African Americans. You understand? You understand? These men right here, we know who we are. And we're raising the nation up, man. Trying to find something to follow Had loyalty, every man tried to borrow Felt pain and a lot of sorrow Got betrayed, so packed I didn't even have my heart broke Living confused, about to lose hope Cops got me on the side of the road Like a sideshow, need an antidote before I croak Now I'm setting fire to rhythm man blues Call this guitar smoke Rebel with no cause, trying to find direction The world got me vexed Picked up a bad lick of habit that's hereditary from oppression Felt like my life was on fire trying to find an exit Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck Sometimes a follower is a soldier Trying to find a good ship Plus when you in hell, how do you excel? Wisdom the breath of life, I don't believe in fairy tale Listen well to what I tell No calling can cause pain Something that a rebel knows very well can't you tell I was sent from the Lord? Got a tongue like a two-edged sword.